Good morning, good day, whatever you are in the world, and be welcome over here. Gotta do a bit today about the market, Bitcoin, altcoins, the Maxi Trading Group, and uh, where we're heading to, what we're going to do, what we're going to trade, are we going to short, are we going to long, are we going to swing trade, what is the plan, what is going on uh, on the Open TG Group? Uh, <laughs> The fam, the fam, the retail fam is really growing, and a lot of retailers are really sharing charts, sharing opportunities, sharing altcoins. Uh, they are trading a lot over there, a lot of trades. I'm seeing a lot of trades, uh, a lot of shit coins also that have been. They are trading a lot of shit coins. So, guys, just to be clear, first of all, the maxi trading group is free so you don't have to pay 100 bucks 200 bucks 300 bucks all those bullshit private courses private uh, 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 webinars uh, private this private that fuck all that shit fuck all that shit it's just how it is it's just it's free and anyone is equal and everybody is equal so we help each other i'm here to chart the team I'm going to be directly with you guys. I'm struggling with them because why? They want a paid group and I'm against any paid group out there. So I'm struggling with the team and they really want a paid group. They want a group of maybe like 20, 30 persons paid. And I'm against that and I will not support it. So uh, it's a bit, uh, so we're struggling over there. So, you know, I thought to myself, as long as you guys don't want to work along, I will do it myself. I will do it myself. So, for now, what to expect from the private trading group? The private trading group, guys, you have to understand this is a free group, so you're not paying anyone or whatever. The only thing that uh, the requirement that you have to do to join that group, and the team also requires that, is that you use the Maxi link. So you trade on Maxi. So the link is below. You have to make an account on Maxi and you have to also be active trading there. That's the only way to get into the group. So you don't have to pay no money. No, no money. You pay nothing. The trading group is over there. And what you expect from that spare trading group is I share my analysis and my possible trade setups that I will be doing. That's what I share over there. So it will not be the, 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 the signal groups or whatever you're expecting. No, I will train you guys to be traders and how to think, where to look, how to chart, what to use, what tools to not use, etc, etc. So it's more of an education than a signal group. It's an education group and I also share what I will be doing. And the past week's massive 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 winning streak from the team because they have been making sick gains and how they did it it's very simple i share what i'm going to do and they follow along and they're making sick gains because yeah i'm not going i let the team talk about what they're how my they're, they're on the tg group sharing it on twitter sharing it i'm not going to talk about myself but that's just what i do so okay so that's about the maxi trading group if you want to join paying the lowest fees available, 70, 80% discount. So don't do it for the trading group, do it for yourself. You're trading now on whatever Binance, Bybit, KuCoin, whatever exchange you're, pay, you're, you're trading on, you're paying 70, 80% more fees than Maxi. That's just how it is. And I got also someone was telling me, Maxi, something with money laundering, and it's a bit of a scary exchange. Every freaking unregulated exchange is a risky place. So don't come tell me you're trading on KuCoin, you're trading on BingX, and you're trading on Bybit, and you're trading on Binance, you're trading on whatever, and then you come tell me Maxi, well, maybe, or maybe KuCoin is a bit dangerous. Every freaking exchange is the same. They're all the same. So always know your risks. If you want to have safe, if you want to be safe and you want to be, you can sleep at night and nothing is going to happen, there's a link below Bitfavo. That's the only exchange regulated by the Dutch uh, bank that, and they also have got a guarantee uh, fund. So over there, you can, you can, you can deposit your money and you can buy your crypto and you're safe. That's Bitfavo. That's the only one in the world where, that I know where you can buy crypto 
without without all the, without, without, without to worry about regulations etc or maybe it will be forbidden etc etc so i really Bitfavo is the only one and by the way Bitfavo you can also you don't need to buy any stable tether or whatever you can just buy crypto with euros directly with, with with fiat money you can buy crypto and sell crypto with money with fiat money so Bitfavo is the by far the only one and if you come telling me well maxi laundering this that they all the same they are all the same so i've been trading on exchanges for years and years and when markets start to ramp up you always have got these the, the, these fuds coming out and sometimes they're also true because we've saw ftx what happened to it but even if we would look at binance they're even being charged and, 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 and etc but the assets are safe on the binance exchange Nobody lost any money, nobody get wrecked, nobody has gotten stolen, at least not for what I know. And Maxi is a new player and for sure they want liquidity on their exchange because they need to grow. And they're, they're starting to become a big player in the, in, the, in, the bit, in, in the crypto market because why? They offer the lowest fees. And I have to say, all the exchanges started that way. They were promoting low fees, etc., etc. And the moment they got a lot of customers, that's when they started to hire up their fees. When they got, when they they got rich, they made all the money, and then they started. So Maxi, I think that the same will happen by time. But until that time, I can save myself like 70, 80 percent on trading fees. So why would I be stupid and go pay? 70 80 percent more more fees on other exchanges why why would i do that okay everyone for himself let's jump in bitcoin okay bitcoin guys in also in the in the in the in the in the in the, in the, in the trading uh, group they started opening some shorts when we got the, when we got that pullback and i told them listen guys it wasn't this pullback and I've been saying this, by the way, from here and here, and I said it here and here. I really don't get these influencers on CT. Also the biggest ones, the biggest influencers, you know. I'm not going to name any names, but the biggest ones. When we got a drop like this, they start yelling, oh, wait a minute, we're going to the 37K. We're going to the 38K. Like my friend Ran tweeting, we're going to the 37K. We're going to the 38K. Uh, we're going to dip more. We're going this, we're going that. And I also responded to him, well, he didn't respond to me, but I told him, as long as we're holding the indicator, we have to remain bullish. We can't be bearish as long as we're holding this. We have been holding this line from 16th of October. We've been holding the indicator on the day, and I'm telling him, every time we come to it, look at it, just... Just look at it. By the way, if you don't have the indicator, there's a link below to my OPTG group and you can get it also for free. Everything is for free. When you're following M. Will Keller Retail Fam, free. Free, free. You never pay a dime for anything. That's how we are different from the rest. Everything is for free. So you don't have to ask me, oh, how, what? No, no, no. I know, I know, I know some people on CT, and I think that you guys also know them on YouTube. They have similar indicators. They sell them for one thousand dollars, or five hundred bucks, or six hundred bucks, or seven hundred bucks. A lot of crap. It's for freaking free. Just go to my TG group. There is a section M Will Killer. You're gonna copy the code. You paste it in your Pint Editor. And you've got the same indicator and it's for free okay so you cannot call for 37k if we can't even get into the indicator look at it look at it just 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 look at this guy look at this this was the first one look it didn't even want to touch it boom up over here same thing boom up here over here. it didn't even touch it boom up so how can you call for 37 38k if this thing doesn't even want to break or touch it and it's holding from October. And I also, also uh, on Twitter, I, I shared it to run. I told him you're wrong because the indicator was still, we have to remain bullish. We have to remain bullish. So, so in the trading group, what they did is over here at this point, they started opening some longs and I made some nice gains, made some nice gains. So 
that's about bitcoin and guys bitcoin about uh, jerome powell yesterday guys uh, i can talk like an hour about jerome powell uh, what he did yesterday i have to say i agree with him and why do i i will explain it very short power has been 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 warning the markets for over a year now slow the fuck down wall street slow the fuck down and what they did is every time when they hear them be hawkish what they do is they pre-pump the markets so i've also shared this a lot of times and a lot of people i know have become very rich with that Two, three days before Powell opened up his mounts, the market start pumping. So I think that Powell had enough of this shit. He, had, he just had enough of this shit. He has been saying this for, 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 for a year. Guys, be careful, be careful. And every time what Wall Street does, they do the opposite. But what happened is that the markets kept pumping and we are all time highs on the markets over now. So over now, what he did is in my opinion very very smart because what he did now he's forcing but what because what he was doing is he was creating the bearish sentiment to the retailers and the market makers the wills the rich people like i've been saying they're all, all in on stocks they have been pumping and wrecking all the uh, sentiment buyers so the retailers that were shorting the the the, the, the stocks or were shorting the nasdaq and they were shorting whatever out there they have been totally wrecked because every time when paul tells them wait a minute we, we are there's bearish we're gonna tighten we got this we got that every time those those rich the wills the elite was wrecking retailers on their shorts now he has changed he has told them no wait a minute i'm not going to do this anymore for now I'm going to tell you we're going to cut rates next year and for the people that are educated in the economic markets in the past uh, in the history when rates get uh, cut that's when the dumps begin because a lot of people don't know this they think wait a minute when uh, the fed starts cutting rates that's when markets will explode no the history tells us something something else when the rates start uh, uh, when they start cutting rates that's when the dumps will become will come but it's a long story J just just let, let us focus on bitcoin now bitcoin what now happened what powell did is powell opened up the the, the 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 doors of hell that's how i see it he opened up the doors of hell so you guys you degens you want to you want to go all in on stocks you want to pump every mark you want to do it well i'm with you guys go pump the shit out of everything but what will happen now now we have to be cautious because why those same people that have been pumping the markets for the whole year they are the same people that are now over here so will they now start hunting down retailers on their longs will they now start flipping from hunting shorts to uh, short uh, to, to hunting longs and this is something you don't have to worry about in the trading group i will be the one that will be eyeing that and i will be that's my thing that's my work i will be on it only if i'm on on, on holidays that's when i'm not on the charts but when i'm on the charts that's my thing so when that happens i will warn you like i've always done so don't worry about that one but we have to expect that the volatility will increase to the upside and also to the downside that's going to happen and we need to be prepared for that so for the trading group the trades that will be shared will always be in and out trades so meaning you go in you take the damn profits you're out and then you go in again profits out in again profits out and that's how we keep building 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 our portfolios when and if a dump happens suppose that this thing will get broken and we will come back to the 37k 35k or maybe even the 31k levels that's when we start buying midterm in that's when we start buying in and holding for a 2x 3x 4x 5x that's when we start making a portfolio this is what i bought let's suppose uh, gilomar went to 20 cents suppose that pith went to 30 cent or 25 cent suppose that uh, polka dot came back to five bucks suppose that uh, whatever coin you're out there you're bullish on suppose it made the 30 suppose ocean went to 40 35 cents etc etc that's when we buy in and we huddle we huddle and that's 
has to be like in my case it's maximum of 20 to 30 percent trading portfolio i'm not talking about investment portfolio investment portfolio i won't buy anything until bitcoin drops down to 20k or lower so that's that didn't change by the way no power gonna change that no spot etf gonna change that nobody's going to change that that's my money i have it over there when bitcoin decides to crash down and that's where I'll be ready and having cash while everyone else is all in and doesn't have a dime to buy the dip. Because I have to remind you guys, in the past of Bitcoin, we have been seeing such a long time of very much strength in the markets. And, and we didn't get any flash crashes. We didn't get big dumps. We didn't get nothing. We're just going up step by step in its building. And I'm bullish on crypto long term. No, 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 no discussion about that. But you have to keep in mind that there will be moments when they will drop down that Bitcoin like a like a block. It, 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 it's going to happen. And when it happens, be sure that you have some money to buy in. Don't be that stupid guy that is that is that is, that is all in on his on his crypto. And when the crash happens, he sees his money. Like we say in Dutch verdampt verdampt means it it, it 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 went up in air so what i'm trying to tell you guys now for now i'm going to focus on short short term trades so in and out in and out in and out so for now bitcoin that's bitcoin what did i wanted to show you guys else i wanted to show you guys something else the dominance chart dominance chart it it's starting to it's starting to show really weakness over here so over here we've got this support level over here but i think that if bitcoin if bitcoin starts to ramp up because bitcoin is a bit let me let me go back to bitcoin let me show it on the on the on the lower time frames so over here we've got something like this this is what you have to keep an eye on guys let me put it like this we have to break this trend we have to we have to, we have to break this one and go up and try to make new highs but for now we're just like they say we're just fucking around <laughs> we're just fucking around. it's it's flat so it's uh, nothing is happening over here there's really nothing happening over here it's just going sideways this could be very good if this thing just drops down because we try to break out of this one it was a fake out and we're now back so if this thing will come back to this regions over here this would be very bullish let me put on my alarm to know how why and when so if this thing will continue to come down several altcoins will probably gonna gonna pop up yes i remember what i was going to tell you guys in this bit I, I, what important is i see a lot of people they're trading they're trading altcoins i'm bullish on this one they're charting uh, it's on the support level uh the indicator is holding it this that etc 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 no 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 guys if you're if you're trading altcoins you have to first always check the bitcoin chart so before you open up a trade on whatever altcoin out there you have to first open up the bitcoin chart and for sure there are some times when bitcoin drops and some altcoins just go up then you have to you have to check the btc pair of the altcoins suppose you're trading solana and solana is is, is going up and bitcoin is coming down go check the solana btc pair because probably the, the, the BTC pair chart is going up, is go is going up very hard, and that's the only. But that's maybe one percent, two percent of altcoins. But the rest of the altcoins, when Bitcoin starts to to go down, they go down with it. So when you're trading, suppose I want to make a trade and I'm seeing a nice uh, a nice long. Uh, the first thing that I do is wait a minute. Where are we? Let me go to the one hour. Where are we? Okay, well. We're over here. We're uh, reaching some support over here. We've got this support level over here. We've got support level over here. We've got also the indicator over here. So if I wanted to long a coin, um, when this thing comes over here, I know that there is some support on Bitcoin. That's when I would open up a long on an altcoin. And if this thing just breaks down, that means that I'm going to take my losses and, and just get the freak out. But this is how, how you trade altcoins. You have to first of all check the Bitcoin chart because as long as Bitcoin is going down, don't expect a lot of upside on your altcoin. Or it has to be in the one or two percent of the altcoins that are outperforming Bitcoin on the BTC pair. Capish? 
Do you understand what I'm trying to? This is very important. Very, very, very important. Because again, guys, in the Maxi Trading Group, I will be sharing a lot, but I will train you guys that because at the end of the road, what I want is that you guys are the ones that are going to tell me, MB, could you check the V chain chart? Why? Because it's breaking out on the BTC pair and it's also breaking out on the, on the ETH pair and on the USDT pair. It's doing this, it found some support and we're gonna, ha we're gonna have a, uh, it's, it's a cup and handle pattern and it's going up. So you guys will tell me, MB, this is what we're seeing, this is what we're gonna do and do you agree? I will check it and I'll say yes, I agree. And maybe you will be the ones that are telling me because I cannot watch a thousand coins. I'm training you guys to get ready for when the FOMO and the moon will start. And when it starts, you have to be educated. So you're going to get free freaking education. The only thing you have to do, you have to use the Maxi trading link below and you have to trade on it so guys i'm not going to make this vid any longer i wanted to talk about some other stuff also but i think that this this is very important these steps that i showed you now so when you're trading out when you're trading like meme coins or uh, you're on the luna coins and whatever it's another story those things they are just uh, they don't have any correlation with bitcoin they just pump when they want to pump or those very low cap gems they really don't care about what bitcoin is gonna do because it's just too too low of low cap but when you're trading uh, uh mid 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 caps uh, normal low caps uh, the, the the ones that have got like uh, uh 200 300 plus they really you really need Bitcoin chart Bitcoin first find a plan see what it is is it at a possible uh, at a possible support level could it go up from here yes okay this is when I will go into my trade and that's also how I share my setups and that's also how I know 80 90 percent of my trades because it's not only watching the 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 the, 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 the atom chart and just thinking oh well maybe it could go up here uh, let me share uh, i'm bullish on atom you think that it works like that it doesn't work like that it, there is a lot of things that you have to combine to find the winning trade and that's how the team also made the one of the best streaks ever they're like four weeks making trades and they still till the day of the day didn't lose one of them. I'm still waiting for the red one to share it, but they just didn't. And it's annoying me a lot, by the way. Guys, push on the like, please. Share the vid. Make some noise. We're growing. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice one. Bye-bye.